You, yes, you. If someone disagrees with your viewpoint or doesn't like what you say, have they ever accused you of being racist? You know how frustrating and confusing it can be, right? Our goal today is to shed some light on the psychology behind these accusations. Make sure you stay tuned, because this is not one you want to miss. Racism accusations can't be generalized in all situations, and there can be differences among individuals. We are here to provide you with a psychological perspective that might help you better understand and cope with the challenges you face. Hello, I shall be narrating for Gino DiCaprio. We're glad you're here, so let us start with 1. Projecting Projection It is possible that these accusations can be explained by a psychological phenomenon called projection. In short, projection occurs when individuals attribute their own unwanted or unacceptable thoughts, feelings or beliefs to others. Consequently, when someone disagrees with your viewpoint, they may project their own biases or prejudices onto you to divert attention from their own internal conflicts. 2. Confirmation bias. In addition, confirmation bias plays a role. Some people may interpret your statements through a biased lens because of their strong political views or agendas. Information that confirms their pre-existing beliefs is more likely to be sought, interpreted, and remembered by them. Due to this, they may only pay attention to aspects of your speech that align with their views and ignore or misinterpret those that don't. You could receive a racist label based on this bias, even if the intent of your words was entirely different from theirs. 3. Emotional reasoning. It is also important to consider emotional reasoning. An individual's feelings can affect their judgments or beliefs when he or she feels strongly about an issue. You might be categorized as racist because of this emotional response, regardless of your actual content. Understanding that emotions alone do not determine a judgment's accuracy is imperative. We should point out that these explanations are not exhaustive and may not apply to all situations. There is no definitive explanation for every human interaction, as human interactions are complex. However, Engaging in respectful and open dialogue can be beneficial when facing accusations of racism. As a result, misunderstandings can be clarified, and gaps in perspectives can be bridged between you and those who accuse you. As far as accusations of racism are concerned, that's what we think. It's time for you to share your thoughts. Can you tell us what you think? Is this something you agree with or disagree with? Feel free to leave a comment below. For more content like this, follow this page and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it.